Well, hello, rock fans and fossil lovers. Let's do another slabbing video. In this video, we'll take this big fossil rock and get some slabs off of it. So Kendra and I were out rock hunting yesterday in Central Texas, and we stumbled upon this mighty big fossil rock. As you can see, it has lots of really cool little shell fossils in there. Oh, it's just loaded. But what's most exciting is what's on the other side. Check this out over here. Look at that gastropod, or what a lot of people say, Turatella fossil right there. Just perfectly cut in half by nature. Are there more in here? There should be. I can see little hints that there are other Turatellas, maybe head on, not in profile like that. Let's find out. This would be a good one to slab. Now what I'm gonna do, I wanna save this half of the rock that has that. So this will be slab, but only to about that point there so that when it's done, we'll still have this whole half up here featuring that Turatella. But this other half is fair game. So I'm gonna take this in, in the shop. I'm gonna get a lot of slabs off of it. And then I'll bring them back here and show you what they look like. Okay, the slabbing's all finished. How did we do? Let's take a look here. We'll begin with this little end piece. Now remember, our goal was to catch something really cool on the inside, and did we? Well, now I just see a lot of shells in there. Okay, let's get started with the first full slab. I don't see any more of the gastropods or the turatella. I mean, this could be a little end view of one right here, that round thing, but it's hard to say. Nothing in profile. Okay, let's move on. Are we gonna catch one here? Hmm. Some interesting stuff, like right down here. Lots of shells. I like this thing right up here. Whatever that was, you can see it on both sides, but it's not the Turatella. Next one, will we get lucky and, oh. It's a good looking slab in my opinion, and I think it would make a beautiful cabochon. I know this stuff takes a great shine, but no Turatella profiles yet. Still lots of neat stuff in there, don't you think? Look how much life was in this rock right here. All right, got two more to go here. Will we get lucky? Uh, hmm. Well, like I said earlier, this may be some head on Turatella we're seeing in here, just not in profile. It's hard to say. Yeah, that's interesting right up there, whatever that little long thing is right there. Interesting. Let's see, one last full slab here. Hmm. I'm not seeing what I want to see. I'm not disappointed, mind you. I think this is still a beautiful stone, and I know I can make a gorgeous cabochon out of this stuff. But darn it, I was hoping to see a profile of a Turatella. So that leaves us with this, and what we went ahead and did at this point was, this was Kendra's suggestion, she said, why don't we cut this thing in half? Maybe we'll get lucky, because we didn't get lucky here, as you can see. But maybe if we cut it like that, what do you think? Will we get lucky? Let's take a peek. And that's stuck together with oil. Ooh. Whatever that long thing is right there, that's really cool. And this might be something of a Turatella right here, maybe. But not in profile. Oh, wicked cool stuff though, right? Let's see this side. Oh, there's still lots of oil on this. So like something small like that. Is that a little end on Turatella right there maybe? Hmm, ooh, this one here, that may be one as well, right there. That looks like a bigger one and we've just cut through it right there. But gosh darn it, we didn't get 
any more profiles like this. I was robbed. <laughs> oh well, that's how it goes sometimes. You never know what's inside these. It's all random. We could have just as easily cut through several in profile, but we didn't. Well, I'm not unhappy with this rock. I think we should grade it. I like the way this thing slabbed, and I'm going to give this a solid B+. Well, listen, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. It was sure fun cutting this thing and searching for the Turatella profile, the elusive Turatella profile. Didn't really find it on the inside, but we did find some other cool things like, what is this long thing right here? Look at that. What do you suppose that was millions of years ago? Some kind of shell, some sort of plant? I have no idea. That's what makes this so fun. You just never know what you'll find. Well, once again, thank you so much for watching. I do appreciate you. And please remember to check my other videos for more like this. Thanks again.